अपना कोर्स गेट स्मार्ट गेट अहे Calculate the present value of five thousand dollar expected to be received after two years if interest rate is three percent per quarter. Now notice that the interest rate is being given as three percent per quarter and not per annum. Now let's define the timeline. Can I say before I go to the timeline? Can I say two years is equivalent to eight quarters? So when I draw the timeline, I draw it like this, from zero right up till eight, because there are eight periods of one quarter each. Now the question is, if you're expecting to receive five thousand dollar at the end of eighth quarter, what will be the present value of this five thousand dollar today, if rate of interest is three percent per quarter? Now in this case, can I define n? As eight, so n, which is two years, is eight quarters, so eight periods. And for each period, the rate of discounting is three percent per quarter or per period. So I save these numbers into the calculator. I press CE. Then I press eight. Save that as n. I press three. Save that as i by y because it's three percent per period. PV is what I need to calculate. I'll skip that for the time being. I'll save PMT as zero. Then I'll save five thousand dollar positive as F three because that's the amount that I'm expecting to receive after eight quarters. And quickly calculate the present value. Now the number I'm getting on my calculator is three nine four seven point zero four seven. And what does that mean? The present value of five thousand dollar is three nine four seven point zero four seven. This needs to be negative. Let's take another example. Calculate the present value of nine thousand dollar expected to be received after four years. Interest rate is twelve percent per annum, compounded semi-annually. Now again. Can I say twelve percent per annum compounded semi-annually is nothing but six percent per six months? Now let's draw the timeline. Can I say that four years is equivalent to eight periods of six months each? So I draw my timeline from zero to eight. So it's made up of eight periods of six months each. I'm expecting to receive nine thousand dollar at the end of eighth period. What is the present value of this nine thousand dollar today? Is the question. Can I say n in this case, which is four years, is eight periods? So it becomes eight. And for each period, I'm earning six percent. Per period. Remember, the question was twelve percent per annum, so six percent per period. I need to calculate the present value, so I'll plug in these numbers into the calculator. N is eight, so I'll first press eight, then n. I'll then press six. Save it as i by y. I'll skip PV because I need to calculate PV. PMT needs to be saved as zero. The future value is nine thousand dollar. So that's the amount that I'm expecting after uh, four years in this case, and then I'll compute the present value. Now the number that I'm getting on the calculator is five six four six point seven one one three. What does that mean? The present value of nine thousand dollar is five six four six point seven one one three. So that was uh, the future value and uh, present value of single cash flow. Apna course, get smart, get ahead.